quick virtual tour of the truck now that I'm done. I got the bumper on there and the fog lights and there's the headlights and actually these rings right here and there turn on at the same time as the fog lights. I'll show you that in a minute. So, bug deflector, just painted that, came with the truck. There's the bigger tires, and if you go in here, we're going to see, that's the new shock, this is the A-arm, and down here is the tie rod. And then if you look in there, right there, this is the front differential. Over here, it's the body blocks for the uh, body lift. There's a frame, nothing special, just not rotted. There's that cab corner that used to be a massive hole in it. Got that replaced and done up real nice. And then, this right here is a leaf spring. And, oh, new gas tank. That was rotted away bad. In here, that's the filler tube. It just, you can see it goes up. That's where you fill the gas, goes straight down to the tank. Alright, bring it up to the back. This is the tunnel cover. Just got that recently. The tail lights and the rear roll pan. That's this. I had it. I had an old one before, it was fiberglass. That's the one you see in the pictures on the slide. This one's metal, it's uh, welded on there, bondoed up, made it look real nice. And those are the tailpipes right there. And if you can see this, I'll show you from over there later. But these are the shocks for the rear suspension. And come over here and I'll show you. This right here is the muffler, and it's not in fact true dual because it goes back from one muffler. If you go all the way back, all the way down from the motor, it's going to come back from two cat, from the two headers down to two different cats, catalytic converters, two different mufflers, all the way back to two different tailpipes. Mine goes two headers down to one cat, one muffler, and two tailpipes. And this side, the other cab corner was taken care of, as you can see. My good friend Nate, he uh, did the paint and the body work for me. He bondoed up the, uh, that roll pan over there and put the cab corners on for me and did the paint. That was actually his senior project. If you're uh, in the crowd right now, thank you very much for doing that. If you're wondering the, where the tailgate was, actually, that he has it right now if he has to redo it. Um, if we go inside, you can see the seat covers. They are not just Walmart seat covers. I actually ordered them online custom to the truck. And this, I replaced this as well because these lights were not working. So I had to... It was because of this switch. And I'll show you this back here. This is my subwoofer. And back there is my amp. This actually has an amp on it that powers the sub. And this amp back there is for the four speakers. Which, there's one of the speakers. It's the exact same on the other side. They're all kicker, all four are kicker, all the subs and amp is kicker. That's a brand new Sony radio. And let me show you the lights turned on real quick. In my opinion, it looks fantastic. It looks better when it's darker out. But you can see the headlights, those halos on them are turned on at the same time as the fog lights. 
And I'm just going to also apologize for the noise because I'm doing this on my lunch break in the McDonald's parking lot. But that's the truck. Hope you guys liked watching my presentation as much as I enjoyed building the truck.